My name is Bruce Miller. I'm the vice president, one of the owners with my wife, Dr. Lisa, of Excel for Life. We really appreciate you being a patient and a patron of our clinic. We thank you for that business and your trust in us taking care of you and your family's health. Today's session is going to be about our patient portal, which is a advanced way for you to communicate with Excel for Life through the portal 24-7, so you'll have access to your medical records, to your providers via email, and also to be able to ask for prescription refills and to make appointments. Now I will uh, introduce Jamie McClure, our Director of Administration, to show you the technical aspects of the program and demonstrate how to get to it and what the screenshots look like so you'll be able to navigate around very easily. I'll start off by introducing myself. My name is Jamie and I'm the Director of Administration here at Excel. And I um, just want to start off by introducing our patient portal. As you can see, we're starting out on our website here. Um, you have two different options here where you can log in. Um, you've got this login option or you can also come down here um, to communicate with us. There's also options on here to um, contact us if you have any difficulties getting in. And that'll send an email directly to us and then we can be in contact. Um, so we'll go ahead and log in here. Okay, so when you see when you start out, you have a couple different options. You can use these um, boxes down here to click on as you need, or up here we've got a panel um, that lists all the options that are available on here. Um, we'll start at the top here. The lab and diagnostic reports, um, anything under there, if you've had any labs done, any diagnostic reports that we have ordered, um, will show up in here with results. If you click on it, it'll pull it up here. This is just an x-ray, so it simply just says normal, but if you were to have any labs, it would pull all your numbers as well. Um, and you have an option to print. So if you ever need them for your own records or anything like that, that option's available. Um, next, a visit summary. That's basically your office visits with us. Um, in this example, they would all be listed here if you had multiple. You can click on it and see what was done in that visit. Any medications, anything like that will be there for you to access if you forget. Um, also available for you to print as well if you need it for any specialist appointments, anything like that. Um, next, the personal health record. It pretty much sums up your office visit as well. Gives you a little bit more details because um, it includes your x-ray as well. And the PHR view, I think pretty much gives you a couple different options here. If you have any known allergies, those will be there. Um, any procedures, which includes any um, injections or immunizations given, those will be on there as well. Last vitals that you had done here in the office will all pull here, so if you need to um, have any of that information as far as your blood pressure or anything like that a current list of all your medications and immunizations and any labs or diagnostic reporting as well. Um, referrals, that just sums up any referrals that we've done for you. Um, if you've requested been sent to a specialist or anything, it doesn't really show you a whole lot on that, but you can also choose to request one. So if you know you have a specialist appointment coming up, um, you can send us a request um, to take care of that for you. Um, the My Account, the next option under there is um, personal information. If you need, have anything that you need to update in your chart as far as address, phone number, anything like that, you can come in here and do that, do that and it will send us a request to get that updated. There's also an additional information that has a little bit more personal information as well, including pharmacy and that kind of thing. You can reset your password here. And also it shows you your last statement and any past statements. So if you have any balances, you can get on here and look at those as well. Um, hopefully the pay to option will be up soon, that you can come on here and pay a balance as well, but that's not up and running quite yet. Um, here's all your options to send us messages. Um, these are any messages that we have sent to you. So as you can see on that, there's a response back um, from the nurses. 
You can do a um, compose a generic message here to fill in and send us. Um, you've got a refill request. It'll pull up any medications that we have current on your list and all you have to do is check them. You have a drop down which has a numerous amount of pharmacies in there and you can hit on the letter to kind of, so you don't have to drag through them all. And it didn't do it that time, did it? There we go. If you don't find yours on the list, there is a spot where you can just type it in in the box as well if you can't locate it on there. Um, lab request, if there's any labs you want to have done, say you have a physical coming up, you normally get labs done, you can send us that request so we can get that taken care of in advance. And we kind of touched on the referral request. Um, appointments, you can view your appointments, you can schedule appointments from on here and reschedule, cancel, all those options are available. And basically what it'll do, um, please provide us as much information as you can, that way we don't have to keep continuing um, conversations back and forth, that way we can get you scheduled to a time convenience that works for you. And those all come to our staff and they'll just communicate back with you, um, usually by email unless you request otherwise. Um, historical appointments will just show all your past appointments or any pending. Um, questionnaires, um, that pertains mostly more to our new patients, um, but it's on here if you feel like there's any information that you've forgotten to give us. Um, it's family history, social history, um, that kind of stuff about about you personally. And that goes directly into your chart very as well, so it's very nice for the providers to have. Um, surgical and allergies, if you have a surgery, um, you can come in here and fill it in, that way you can let your provider know. And we can have it in your chart. The health tracker we're not using right now. And then the My Devices, um, as you guys might know, if you don't already know, we now have an app available um, that you can communicate with us right now. It's only available for the iPhone. You can basically download the app on your phone. And we've got the steps here. So you can do not everything that you can do on the portal, but most of the basics that most people would want to do from their phone. You can send us messages, viewer request your appointments, um, request refills, and the app is free. The app is called Hilo. So you can go in and search for that. Once you get into there, um, you're gonna type in our practice name and do a search. And as you see, it pulls us up right there. So then you'll select on us. Your same username and password that you use on the website will work for this as well. You're gonna do that one time and then you're gonna set up a PIN so you won't have to continue to use that same login and password. You'll set up a four digit PIN. It's gonna ask you to agree to its terms to use it. And this is where it's gonna ask you for your four digit PIN and you're gonna have to do that twice. And then once you do that, you'll be in there. And then from then on, you'll just type that four digit PIN to get in and you won't have to worry about your username and password and keeping track of that information. So it makes it a little bit easier than having to go through all those steps. Um, you can also link additional patients. So kids, spouses, anything like that. You'll all be under the same um, four digit code as well. And that'll be there for you to use. As you can see, it's got some icons there that are pretty basic to send messages to view or request appointments, to request refills, or you can view your lab results as well. Okay, well thanks for joining us. If you have any further questions, you can definitely give us a call at 317-660-0888. Thanks again for your participation in this session. We hope that it was beneficial and informative to you. Obviously, if you have any other additional questions, you can certainly contact us through the contact section on our website or through our office phone at 660-0888. And we wanted to then talk just a minute about the eMember Advantage program. Some of you have already taken advantage of this fantastic program that we offer. It's very unique. It gives you the ability for a very nominal fee per month 
to have access to the providers on a limited basis for easy office visit type things over the web. It gives you access to our fitness room anytime that the facility is open. It gives you the ability to look at private content on our website, which is a vast amount of content related to medical information, all kinds of different health and family and faith related topics that are available in the exclusive area strictly for e-members. And then it also gives you, and perhaps most importantly to a lot of our patients, gives you a perpetual discount on supplements. So you will get a 5% discount every time you purchase supplements if you're an e-member here at Excel for Life Family Care and Pediatrics. So check it out.